Welcome to the UTA Housing website. Today we're going to show you how to apply for a residence hall or UTA apartment. From this page, click on the Apply Now button. This will take you to the Apartment and Residence Life page. For this example, we'll click the Residence Hall option. If you're looking for an apartment, click on the Apartment option. This is the Housing Portal. The first step will be to log in. Head to Students Log In Here and enter your Net ID and password provided to you by UTA. Now that you've reached the home page, click on Residence Halls in the menu bar. Choose Term Selector and select the term you want to apply for. For example, we'll be using Academic Year 19 to 20. Each term includes the semester dates that are covered by that particular term. Next, you'll be entering your personal and contact details. Don't worry about the first selection. It can't be edited, and it will download automatically from MyMav within 48 hours. Fill out the rest of the page with your emergency contact, missing persons contact, personal email address, and a few additional details. Up next, you'll fill out a series of questions to create your profile. If you opt into roommate selection in a later step, other students will see this information to determine if you would be a compatible roommate. After that, you'll do your meningitis information. A shot is required by law for all students under the age of 22, and it must be done at least 10 days prior to moving in. Additional information will be available on the Records and Enrollment website. Once you're done reading, check the box at the bottom and continue on to the Centennial Court information page. Centennial Court is a privately owned apartment complex on campus property. If you wish to apply to Centennial Court, contact them directly. If you do not wish to apply there, continue with this application. Answer all the questions at the bottom and click continue. This is the Residential Learning Communities page. Residential Learning Communities, or RLCs, allow students to connect their academic experience to their experiences outside the classroom. Please note that RLCs are available for first-time freshmen only. After reviewing the information, click Add to select your preference. If you're not a first-time freshman, choose Not a First-Time Freshman. If you're not interested in an RLC, choose Not Interested in an RLC. Don't worry, if you change your mind later, that's okay. You'll be able to update this before selecting a room. Continue to the online agreement. Your screen name is your net ID. If your prospective roommate has this information, they can search for you using your screen name. Choose if you want to be searchable by other students. Share a short description about yourself that you'd like other students to see. And after reviewing the online agreement, click Submit Application. Congrats, your application's complete.